Hello, welcome to No Inches DIY. Quick little review video today on the XU1 reciprocating saw, 750 watts. Let me get it out. All right, so it's a good little unit. I just wanted a cheap reciprocating saw to cut up meat, frozen meat, mainly when I was processing my own goats. And it worked perfectly for that. And $50 for one of these was a lot cheaper than buying a meat cutting bandsaw, which could have run into a lot of money. Now this isn't stainless steel, but it's quite easy to clean any bit that's gonna get a bit of meat on it around there. So basically in your basic set, you just get an Allen key to remove this thing here. And you get a couple of these blades one for timber, another one in here for steel. I just bought some of these longer blades. If you're cutting up meat, I'm not quite sure what blades are the best to go. The fine teeth seem to get clogged up with bone, but if you're cutting wood or doing any demo work, these ones are good. They go straight through nails, straight through jarrah. I'll be using it a bit later to do a little job on jarrah where I've got to cut through nails. So I'll attach that at the end of the video. Great little tool, available from Bunnings. All right, I'll give you some quick close-up action here. The way you put the blade in, it's a very simple mechanism. You just push that that way, and the blade just slides straight in. And then you just let it go and it's locked in like that. So very easy to use. Good for meat, good for demolition, especially cutting through nails. All right, let's give this a test in the hard jarrah. Got a few nails there we're gonna cut through. So this is a XU1, $69 from Bunnings. It served me well, cutting meat, cutting jarrah, cutting nails, it does it all.